Affordable housing in the Bay Area is definitely not easy to find, but Governor Brown just signed a bundle of bills to tackle the issue head on. KPIX 5's Jessica Flores is live in San Francisco with the details. Jessica? Good afternoon, Kenny and Michelle. The governor just signed that series of bills just moments ago. Take a look behind me. You're going to see a lot of lawmakers here, dozens of lawmakers gathered, speaking before the governor signed those affordable housing bills, choosing this location, Hunter's View in San Francisco, because this is a site of affordable housing project. It's also one of the most expensive cities in the state. Now, several lawmakers spoke, as I mentioned. We also had a bunch of mayors, LA Mayor Eric Garcetti, SF Mayor Ed Lee, and Oakland Mayor Libby Schaaf all speaking today, calling this a landmark moment and a major step to increase affordable housing. Welcome to the Bay Area. Let's get to solutions. Let's hand out keys. We see it every day here in the Bay Area as we are stuck in traffic next to super commuters who spend two hours driving from a home they can afford to a job that allows them to afford it, driving over growing tent encampments. The California dream is in danger, but this session on top of cap and trade, on top of transportation and traffic mitigation, you stepped up and did something that is a brave step for this entire state. There's a total of 15 bills aimed at increasing the supply of affordable housing. Among the bills, three stand out having the biggest impact, which include one bill that would put a measure on the ballot asking voters to decide on a $4 billion affordable housing bond. Under a second bill, there would be a $75 fee on real estate transaction documents, and that alone is expected to bring in about $250 million for housing programs across the states. Now, other bills will cut some of the red tape to help speed up affordable housing construction. Now, these speakers admit this is not going to be the end of the story here, not going to take care of the entire problem. There is still a housing shortage even with these bills. Now, it's expected these bills will increase uh, affordable housing by some 90,000 affordable housing units. Still, there's a 1.5 million housing unit shortfall. Reporting live in San Francisco, I'm Jessica Flores, KPIX 5.